happy Easter again. It's it's a new year this time. Obviously. Yeah. So I'm gonna go and find the eggs that I've already hidden. Unlike last year. So let's go find the first egg, I guess. There's really no other way to start this video. <laughs> Do you see this cute little setup I have here? Look at this little egg pointer marker thing and the egg itself. This is our first egg. Congratulations, right? I'm staring directly into the sun. It's April 3rd. I mean, I mean, it's April 5th. I'm not, I'm not filming this ahead of time or anything. But it's so nice out, but it's so muddy. And I just, I cannot waste this day because it's like really so super so our first question, which I totally just predicted, was what are you currently annoyed by? And obviously I'm currently annoyed by the fact it's like, it feels like 70 degrees right now. I think it is like 70 degrees. Um, but there's snow all, like everything I'm looking at is snow. And it's just like super duper muddy. And also it's going to snow again tomorrow. On my birthday, I mean yesterday on my birthday, and that's totally not cool. But there's snow, and I, I am just so annoyed by snow. But it's April, so it's it's good. It's getting better. My my top three favorite things about Easter, and they are um, one that the, the the stores, you know, like the stores that get. They, they get all eastery and colorful and it's really really pretty. Number two is the whole church thing. Um, <laughs> I like even when even before I was a Christian, like going to church every Easter was just like super awesome. I loved it. Um, number three is that it's warm like this. Usually, I, that's what, that's like my favorite thing about Easter is that like it means like resurrection basically. You know, like like. Like rebirth, like with everything, like like spring is is here, and it is. So yeah. Do you do you recognize this tree? We went to this tree last year. It was, it was a fun tree to be a fun year. The question is, what was your biggest challenge in the past year? So my biggest challenge of the past year would be, you know, the whole going to California for a month thing. But that was that was obviously also my favorite part of the year because that was, you know, like I had wanted to go to Hollywood since I was that big and I went and it was like everything I'd ever dreamed of, really. Um, of course, it was a challenge because there was a lot of disappointment. There's a car driving by and I have no life. stuff up trees like I was I felt so lost for like that entire month and so alone you know it's like so crazy to fly away somewhere <laughs> like completely on your own not expecting to be on your own but finding out that you are on your own basically like it was it was a challenge but it was like one of those challenges that you you're thankful for like it was it was a good challenge in a good way and it helped me grow a lot oh and the other thing is to make uh, improvise a do-it-yourself Easter project slash craft and I'm going to do that right here. Now, <laughs> you've got string. A string. A hole puncher. Or not a hole puncher, whatever. On paper. And we're gonna cut out eggs. We got our eggs, and then we're going to decorate them. You can't. Where? Okay, our sharpie went where? What? What you do next? <laughs> Bear with me here. Um, you take this, this hole puncher, 
part, part puncher, whatever. You do go in the thing. That'd be awesome. No. <sighs> there we go. There's our first egg. We got our eggs hole punched, and we have our string, and that's all you need. So we're gonna take this, and we're just gonna do that. <laughs> we we're done. I I just know that this is going to go downwards from here on out. Look, you like my egg. Here we go. We we did something. We actually made something, like, in our life. Um, so here it is. All right, cool. So we have our egg. <laughs> egg number four. And um, I kind of wanted to just drop that. Egg. Orange. What do you have for us? The first thing is what goals do you have for 2015? I haven't really thought about this because I haven't really written down all of my goals, but one of them, let's see, I have like, I think I have like 140 videos on YouTube right now. And I think my goal for that is to make that total 300 videos. Which will be fun because tomorrow, yesterday, yesterday's my birthday and I'm supposed to get, um, I'm supposed to get something important for videos. And other goals I have for this year, or not really, I, I'm, I'm, I'm hoping to write a lot more, like write like five short stories, but the other, the, the other side that thing said do something backwards and I have plans for that one but I'm just gonna exit right now okay our second to last egg by the way and the question is what are you passionate about and I think this question has a pretty obvious answer, especially for those of you watching, which is obviously making videos, turning my camera on, just standing in front of it, and like whatever. But also like, like just filmmaking in general. Like I love coming up with video ideas, even if I never actually get to them, which this summer I'm so excited for. I'm also passionate about summer by the way, like the sun and warmth, I just, obviously I can't stand winter because I can't stand being the slightest bit cold. And then our, our little thingy is to turn another holiday decoration into an Easter decoration. And I don't know what I'm going to do for that yet, but it'll be fun. Let's, let's go see what I end up doing for that. Go. It's not gonna be possible. I'm just gonna like have to randomly do it then, because there was I was gonna blow bubbles at a passing car, like a normal human being would. Where were you five years ago today, and where do you wanna be in five years ago today? Um, this is a fun little question thing. Uh, five years ago today, so basically Easter 2010, I was I was in a hospital bed. 
and it was my birthday. So basically the best day ever. Yeah, like my, my lung collapsed. So I was just in the hospital on my birthday. And it, it, it was, it was, it was not the best year ever for me. Probably my least favorite year of my life. I spent 15 days in the hospital because my lung collapsed three times. And so obviously I fell behind with schoolwork and everything like that. I had to drop half my classes. I ended up like failing everything that semester. And a few months later I had my heart broken by my first boyfriend ever and it just, it was not a good year. In five years today, I hope to not be sitting right here in, on a pillow in my family's front lawn. <laughs> I, I think that's, I think that's a pretty worthy goal. Um, but I, I hope to be in Los Angeles or really anywhere warm because I, I, uh, I just, I don't like the idea of spending winters in Vermont where it just lasts forever and ever. I just want to go somewhere where winter stays in winter. So, happy Easter and have a good Easter.